Hello, Gentleman Gamer here, and today we're back playing Eve Online, and we're uh, still on the bit of our exploration run still. Uh, we've made it into another wormhole. Um, this one's a very special one. Uh, only four of them exist in game. They're the the uh, commonly called drifter wormholes, uh, but if you see them on the overview, they're known as unknown wormhole or identified wormhole, uh, and uh, they're named. Uh, and you know their name by looking at the overview, and you see uh, the beacon here. This one is Barbicate, and each one I think is named after a different, like, defensive fortification. Uh, I don't remember off the top of my head. Barbicate was one. I think I made a video on Barbicate specifically in the past. Um, but there's three other ones, and if you warp to this, um, this is actually a site which you can run. When it was first released, it took at least two people uh, to uh, hack something simultaneously, different parts of the, the site, to open up the site further. And so you're going to fight a unique drifter battleship, and that would drop an element of sorts. And if you get an element from each of the four drifter wormhole systems, you combine them into another element, <laughs> which I don't think they've done anything with in-game, tell you the truth. I'm not sure if I can actually see it in here or not. I believe, I think it might be in trade goods, I think. Uh, I'm not sure. Unknown, maybe? Vedette, yeah, either it. Vedette was one. Sentinel is another one. Sentinel, Vedette, Conflux, another one. And then there's Barbicate. And I'm pretty sure it turns into convalesced I think element after that and I really don't think that anything with it <laughs> I, I haven't heard anything anything without another one um, so what they end up doing with it uh, I don't know no idea but that's really such a four I think the storyline kind of stopped at some point with these uh, but they're very interesting uh, wormhole systems because you don't have to scan them down uh, to get to the wormhole because they show up in your overview um, but you do need uh, uh, probes to navigate afterwards so those you know because every other site here other than the unknown anomalies which are kind of like very strange little things you can warp to um, but um, but the systems themselves are kind of interesting because they have lots and lots of signatures here and each one of these signatures is another uh, unidentified wormhole so if you're looking to try to get a certain part of space, this was, these four systems are very useful for that. And um, I think at the time when they first came out, a lot of people use these to navigate around the game. I think they've been somewhat uh, less popular since um, <clears throat> CCP put out those filaments that uh, small gangs can now use to get around EVE a little quicker than scanning these down and finding the right chain and everything. Uh, find the right wormhole connection you want to take but i think for uh very large uh like larger like uh like bomber fleets i think i, st I still think these these wormholes might be useful for that but if you're an explorer and you want your pick of what's what area the game to go into um when you're looking for a high set connection going through going through these signatures is very useful because in my you know what 15 minutes these are all I got. Look at all these null set connections, low set connections, a couple high set connections. Uh, and I stopped at some point because look at this. <laughs> I'm not going to say I scan all these. So I, I did pick one. I didn't actually go through yet because there's some. Now, I did make a video this a long time ago, but I'm assuming I'm going to assume that you guys don't know anything about it. Um, but they, they don't act the same. Right now, I'm in I'm outside of uh, I'm outside of range here, so I can actually warp to it. And we'll see what happens. You cannot walk there because natural phenomena yep. are or, disrupting the ship. Or it gives the unhappy noises. It says you can't warp to it. You have to burn to it. Now, most of the time you think, okay, well, it's not a problem. But the issue is, is that these wormholes have a chance to have drifter battleships come in and out of it. And you really can't predict when they do it. <laughs> so if you want to get to this thing, you have to, I would say, micro warp drive. And be ready on the cloak button. Uh, and cloaking ships do help here. So either a really fast ship with a micro warp drive, 
or um, get lucky. I've done a few times where I just bum rushed it <laughs> just to get through. But this is a a null set connection. It looks pretty stable. Some of the other ones I um, was scanning down, uh, they do look like they're they're on their way out, a little shaky looking. This one looks like it's pretty stable still. So we're gonna start approaching it. You cannot walk oh right. Because natural phenomena are disrupting the ship. So let's approach it, and then we're going to hit D scan because people, even though they're not as popular popular as uh, I first remember them, I still think people still use them. So we got to be careful because they're very useful. I can't imagine people well, everyone to stop using them. So we're going to decloak, hit this, and kind of uh, do a little prayer here because you don't always warp to it. Um, <laughs> consistently sometimes I warped like at 30 sometimes I warped it at like a hundred it's never like um, like a set like when you warp to a hundred on a like, like if you're scanning wormholes in a wormhole system you warp to uh, a, a wormhole at a hundred you're at about a hundred there's all over the place for these ones so it's a little more stressful we'll just be ready just in case because I'm not sure if the drifters will auto this is like just auto target and just blow you up or if it's a slight delay but we're going to be careful just in case oh, they've added some weird little blue effects on these I haven't noticed those before oh, pretty close nothing on D scan we are going to just go in and see what's on the other side of this now you want to hold cloak just in case there's battleships on the other side of this we're in Wicked Creek. Oh yeah. Well, these guys are. I'm not sure they attack on site or not. All right. We got anything here? Oh, I don't see anything. Any signatures here? There's no one in local. Where's Wicked Creek? Unreal Alliance. Legion of. Oh, okay. Is is this the drone lands? Maybe. Maybe it's the drone lands. Uh. I don't know, let's, let's, let's clear this. We don't have to actually, like scan it down, I don't think, because I'm not sure if this helps or not. We'll save it anyway. All right. Joe's, yeah, and Joe's observatory system. Okay, let's, um, that's a lot of anomalies. Uh, let's uh, hit a planet up, I guess. We'll go to a moon. Yeah, add 100. Cloak as soon as we smooth. All right. And we cleared that. Now we can make our bearings, now. Let's take a look. Where are we here? Wicked Creek. Scalding Pass. Uh, Great Wildlands is not really close. Let's see. Yeah, I don't think I've been to Wicked Creek in a long time. Especially now with this character, for sure. Uh, I don't know. Let's um, let's mess on the map a bit because we want to we want to try to avoid people if we can, anyway. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. Destroyed ships. No, you want NPCs, maybe. Let's see. Station count. Uh, here. No, no. This is more PvP, but it might be useful. Nothing out here, <laughs> really. Sounds like a very, very, um, very quiet area here. Uh, where is the one for NPCs? That's what I'm kind of con concerned about. Because if I want to worry about, maybe this is the one. No, that's actually NPCs. Uh, sovereignty, maybe. Uh, nope, not that either. Where is it? Statist it must be in statistics. Average pilots jumps in the last hour. Bounty payout adjustment. What's that mean? Ooh, hello. Uh, no, this <laughs> that's more of a hunter thing, I think. If I was trying to hunt people, um, yeah, I thought I had like a, a metric about uh, actually like killing NPCs. That's not gonna help me because that's for just for me. Server to sovereignty, personal NPC, uh, industry. I don't think industry would be it. Corporation. Yeah, I thought it was in here. Pilots docked. Ships destroyed. I thought it was something in here. 
I think, is it pirate? Is that what it is then? Uh, let's see. So, uh, 200, okay, so here we go. That's what I'm looking for, 50. So there's only 50 ships, of, uh, 50 uh, NPCs have been destroyed. 290, so these need to be a bit more hot spotty. And this like also, these are all both dead ends too, so. Uh, we don't want to. We don't want to go there. Dead ends are not good. Let's go to this one. We will go through one slightly more busy area, and we'll go from there. All right. So let's go to which one is it? O R. All right. All right. We'll see how busy this place is. We do have this wormhole here that's quite stable. And so we can always double back if we get into trouble. We got two here, so we'll probably end up on an intel channel. There's already Helios here. Um, we should just hurry up to that Stargate. Because since no one know we're here yet are you guys the same group unreal unreal union okay um, maybe un are these renters I'm not sure I, I, I know uh, Legion of, uh, of death does have um, does has renters so I'm not, I'm assuming it might be a un uh, a rental alliance. There's one signature here, and no one's here. Part of me thinks it won't be a sight. <laughs> uh, so maybe we should move on, maybe. Or maybe we can just scan it down. Let's go to a planet, a moon, a random one at 100. We'll drop probes. We'll scan it real quick, like. It's only one. And we'll see if we'll find a sight here. We want to. Let's make this a little smaller so I can see local. I'm used to being in wormhole space with this guy, so <laughs> local doesn't matter too much, but it does matter here. It does give you intel. So I'm going to scan this down real quick. We'll see if it's a site or just another wormhole. Having more than one exit isn't bad. The anathema definitely uh, definitely scans down quicker uh, compared to the uh, the um, shenanigany Helios fit I had with the blasters and all that. <laughs> um, it is it is cool having the option to try to kill an explorer. It is rare though, but I like having the option uh, when it does occur because uh, it is neat. It is fun to add that possible gameplay to your exploration and I guess some of the um, uh, some of the new ships that put on to Sissy might help with that as well because oh combat site nope pull on getting out of here all right because I know they were adding a uh, Navy exploration ships so Navy so they're like uh, exploration ships not covert ops ones but you can they have combat bonuses so uh, they have scan bonuses, they you know all that jazz, and um, you know relic analyzer type bonuses, and damage bonuses. So that's very interesting. We can't sneak up on people, so uh, it's, it's getting interesting. Um, let's go back to the map. Let's go back to the map. We are here right now. 564 in the last 24 hours. So that is a lot. I'm assuming it's a regional connection here. What's this? Let's go to that. We have to go through another busy one. So hopefully, again, I'm not sure how organized these guys are, but we'll see. So far, it's been a bit quiet, but this is oh, it's almost 600 uh, NPCs. That's uh, that's a pretty high number for 24 hours. Pretty sure I've seen higher, but. Uh, pretty good, a uh, higher number we saw so far, so might be some people that are actually active. And we'll see if we get anyone chasing us around. 
no. No one's in here. Interesting. Uh, maybe... That's a lot. <laughs> that's a lot. Maybe it's like um, an off time zone. I'm not sure who actually lives here. Let's drop probes. We'll take advantage of that. Cloak up. I know the uh, Legion of XX Death, I believe, is Russian. But I'm not sure if uh, Unreal, Unreal Union, is Russian as well. It might be. No idea. But no one's here right now. And people have been ratting in here. What is the rating here? Military is uh, maxed. So they held it for a while and they use it for ratting. Oh, that was fast. What are you? Uh, in the, oh, the combat site. <laughs> I think Independence is a drone combat site, though. Again, not very useful for my uh, Anathema. It is a very strong ship, of course. Yeah, very tough, but uh, it doesn't have the uh, desired equipment to take down many things. So Until, uh, until CCP adds the um, your ship exploding, causes AOE damage, uh, it's not going to do much, so. We'll deal with what the equipment we have here. Ooh, not the, not much, not much gain on that. Let's zoom in here. A wicked Creek. I wonder who. Um, I wonder who. Uh, Part me without drone lands, but I'm seeing Angel here, so maybe we're not in the drone lands. I saw Legion of XX Death, and usually they have. I remember properly living in the drone lands, but that was a while, so. Wormhole. And I probably shouldn't scan this down for time, but they are useful as we go down the chain here. If we start getting chased, uh, bugging out into a wormhole, usually, not always, but usually it's enough to uh, uh, dissuade uh, Nullsec residents because they don't like uh, following you into spooky space usually because uh, they quickly be become the hunted. <laughs> yeah, so. And uh, spooky space is spooky. Very scary. You don't know who's there. We have a thousand people there, for all we know. Or like zero. <laughs> Just don't know, because half of them are cloaked. Or all of them are cloaked. Out of curiosity, let's warp to it. This is a good, uh, good habit to get into when uh, exploring. Just to see what the terrain is like here. Is this like a high sec? Because that might be useful on, this, on its face. Or is it another null? You know, if you want to bounce out of Wicked Creek. N994. I gotta remember these destinations are. I used to remember them, but I don't. Low security space. Now that is interesting. It looks like a more low sec too. Hmm. I'm kind of curious. Are we near Genesis? I would love to go to Genesis again. Actually, just to, let's peek in. Let's peek in. Just to take a look. A harmless look, you know? And we'll see. I probably show him opposite and then warped in. But I'm already at, what, 60 something? So, yeah, whatever. Amara, Amara is huge, though. So, I think it is the biggest of the uh, uh, four uh, Empire factions. And, uh,. I'm actually not sure where Orlando is, to tell you the truth. The best part about wormhole travel is that you don't know where you're going. <laughs> Other than the very uh, smallest amount of information. Where are you taking us, huh? Whoa, we are in Genesis. Very close. All right. Okay, now we're, we're going. <laughs> we're going in. That's it. That's cool. Oh, yeah. Let's save this. We do have company here. All right, let's see. Um, central point and exit. Okay, uh, let's pull away. Cloaked, of course. There are some signatures here, but I more more want to see the uh, the Eve Gate again. That is cool. All right, we'll save this and we can jump back in the Wicked Creek if we want. Uh, let's take a look. There we go. We got three jumps. 
three jumps. We do have us in some some company though. I don't think this guy has been here before though, so I don't have any. Um... Oh, he's gone. Let's just go for it. Yeah, I don't have any uh, on my other character. I have um, like bookmarks already saved. <laughs> I don't have any for this guy. He's never been here. But I do like coming here because they always um, they do add effects over time, and uh, sometimes they add. Uh, um, I think that there's, if I remember properly, they added, um, like, they added, uh, like, you can see it farther away now, the Eve Gate. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm a couple of jumps out. Well, three jumps out. I figured you'd see it, see it better by now. Sniper EG, oh no, he's a pirate. Let's see, do we see it now? I don't see it now. Maybe it's one jump out, maybe, huh? What do you think? Nothing's on D-scan, and that's in D-scan range, so let's uh, jump into the promised land. Maybe uh, maybe in the promised land we'll see it. Because that'd be really cool. Yeah, I forget people. I guess, it, I guess living here is possible. <laughs> now, I don't, if I remember properly, there's actually used no stations. Uh, NPC stations here, so I guess after... Um, People put in citadels, they can kind of live here now, which is a cool place, cool place to live. Wasn't oh, eating comms, really? Eating come here? How the Trigalvi invasions went this far? All right, that's the sun. All right? Is there Eve Gate? Oh, I don't see it. Unless that's it. I'm not sure. Is that the Eve Gate? I don't know. No. Uh, we have a destination, right? Is there like in the? Do they have it in the stars? Like usually they have like. Uh... Yeah, I don't know. All right. Uh, let's see. Forty-three. Let's uh, go to at a hundred. Just make sure we don't get uh, smart bombed. Okay. Yeah, I didn't know Eden Com and the Triglavia invasions went all the way here, but I guess that makes sense. Alright, let's see. We got some Blood Raiders. Eden Com's taking care of them. Jeez, they're lazy. Alright, it's back up here. Nothing on D scan, so let's put the white warp drive on, get into warp range. I guess we'll actually make. Uh, off gate. Okay, perch, and we'll just call it New Eden. When we get into range, oh, why aren't I moving? Oh, I am moving, just not very fast. All right, once we get into range, this one's gonna be a permanent bookmark. There's some sites here we can, uh, can scan down. I'm just not sure if these people, uh, if this guy wants to kill me or not. And no, not yet, almost. And 150, there we go, nice. All right, so jump on contact. And we'll cloak up. Oh, the, oh is that it? I, I missed it. <laughs> okay, once you get in here, we'll jump out. Oh no, no, it says that guy's in the capsule. Whoa. They have been working on that. That is, um, what's this? Oh, they, this is something else they added. That is, that is amazing. That is beautiful. Now there actually is a, um, a tradition in EVE Online where you actually drop a can, you know? Um, do I have cans on here? No, uh, capsule. Oops, someone left their drones. <laughs> um, what else? No, I don't see it. But people sometimes eat their cans. And, uh, do you mean this one? Nope. All right. All right. So I've actually never seen this before. So let's go to this. Wow, that definitely been working. That looks so awesome. All right, very nice. Very nice. Let's cloak up. Wow. 
That's uh, that's pretty awesome. So what is this? So this is Eve Gate Joint Research Complex. This is new for me. I can't click on these. These aren't actually Corsar Corsar Eve Gate Research Facility. Okay, what's this say? Station acts central hub for House Corsar research efforts in the New Eden system. House Corsar has long been keen to bulwark and expand its power influence within the Amar Empire, relying heavily on its policy of diplomacy, trade, scientific exchange, and the borders of its realms and the Empire itself. Royal heir Ezra Cor. Ursula? <laughs> As we've re emphasized this approach since her accession to the Corsar title, and the House successfully enhanced contacts, cooperation with, and to the, with external entities. House Corsar control of the division of the Genesis Reach containing the New Eden system and the obvious scientific value of studying the Eve Gate wormhole remnant has led to cooper cooperate with the Sisters of Eve. Of Eve. Oh, okay. If you ever read any of the novels, the uh, Sisters of Eve are very keen on the um, on the uh, this uh, what's left of the wormhole here. Even so, House Corsar maintains a careful watch over SOE activities, mindful of the Ministry of Internal Order. Paladin attached to the site, keeping everything that goes on here under their own close scrutiny. Now this is interesting, very interesting. So let's take a look at this. So this is, I'm assuming, Corzor. Click on this. And this must be the Sisters of Eve, a very um, similar station, matter of fact, that you would see in um, uh, uh, what's it called? I can't think off the top of my head. <laughs> Thera. You see uh, a couple of these. I know more than like three, three, and a few ruined ones too. Matter of fact, which is interesting. What how how that happened? <laughs> Take a look at this one. Okay. All right. Let's see here. Okay. Sisters of Eve considered the Eve Gate wormhole remnant an important subject both scientific study and religious faith. Oh, okay. They believe Eve Gate to be a gift from God that is divine will that they study it, thoroughly unlock its secrets. Huh, that's interesting. Sisters maintain that God resides on the other side of the Eve Gate. Oh. Uh. <laughs> if you say so. Uh, God is protecting his followers from within his domain of guards. The SOE are careful to emphasize the scientific nature of their research and avoid discussing their religious beliefs openly with their shared facilities, at least they embarrass their cores or hosts, or be accused of illegal proselytizing. That's a good word. By their enemies within the Amar Empire. Oh, this is a very shaky alliance here, guys. Both are both they're both studying it. And this is kind of what I wanted in um in this system. The system is where the game starts, guys. This is it. This is the where the humans came uh, from um, wherever uh, who knows if it's Earth or some other system, right? And they came through this wormhole, which now collapsed. And it's very, I, like, I want, there should be, like, tons of uh, structures here. There should be, like, lots of ruins, like old Terran ruins. There should be stuff here, right? And it just isn't, you know? So stuff like this is a start. I like this. This is cool, finding stuff like this. I just wish there was, like, stuff you scan down in this system. Even if it's random, like you don't find it every single time, but sometimes you can find it and it's like an old Terran ruin or something, you know, like stuff like that. But this is a good start. I like, I like this. This is cool. Uh, and this, the the work they've been doing on the Eve Gate, it just, it looks awesome. And I, 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 I I'm assuming I just missed it in the last system. Um, but maybe we should come back in, maybe, go back through, and see if we can see it, cause. I'm quite curious if we can see it in the uh, the uh, past system because it's massive. It's like it, it like you, there's a sun here. You just can't see it because it's so big, and it's 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 just beautiful. It's they did a really good job, and there's also a Joe Observatory here. Obviously, it's a uh, it's uh, you know Quinky Dink. You know, just they're really curious about the gate too. You know. We do have people here, though. 
Uh, and there it is. Ah, look at that. Okay, I missed that. It is pointing right at it, too. <laughs> so you can't see in this system, which is really, really cool. All right. That is neat. I'm a big fan of that. <laughs> I wonder if we can see it while we're going into the gate. So let's... Let's, uh... Let's hit the gate. Like this, right? I'm gonna go this. I wonder if we get a cool screenshot. Because that would be pretty cool, not gonna lie. Not quite lined up. But it does look neat. Not gonna lie. Okay. Alright. But, uh, I guess we'll end the video there. Like, I want to do a bit more exploration. But, this is cool. <laughs> I'm a big fan of this, so. We'll end the video here. Uh, thanks for watching. Um, and uh, if you want to see this, guys, you definitely hit up New Eden in here. Genesis. Hit Desto. Maybe you get lucky like me and find a wormhole to it. Um, it is uh, it is very unique in EVE. You don't see anything like it. So, But I'll end the video here. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, of course, leave a like. Like the content, of course, subscribe. And fly safe and fly brave.